sailing. And we made it to Fort Legandros. Do -do 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 -do. All on sails. Okay. I do like sailing. Guy is getting cocky. Where's your life jacket again? Where are we? Where the gun goes. Yeah, where? It's very close to my face. Yeah. This <laughs> place is pretty. In but the Hora. Yeah, we just, took, we just took the bus up with Kai. Yes, we almost didn't do it because it's quite long. We walk up here. But then, we a smart view of Hong Will you please take my dog down now? Thank you. Yeah. No, mommy, daddy made me stand on the big dangerous wall. Good too. Look at this little garden of Eden. hike for our untrained legs. And down there is Dory Man. Hopefully still floating. Do you feel at home babe? Yeah. I don't know how much you love churches. Close to God, finally. Yet you wanted to walk up here. That was weird. I think the... the yeah, we lost it because of the heat wave. The heat wave? My mom also says we're getting wet. She told me that yesterday. Yeah? Yeah. Why? That we seem super weird. Living on a boat together. It's cute, she says, but we're weird. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, Mom. We are weird. <laughs> we love it. joys of being on the lee side it's always great to be on the lee side of the island nice winds and no waves right kai 23 knots of wind six knots of speed But we nearly made it. Just have to go around this corner. So 
so we made it to Shinusa or Skinusa. Very quiet anchorage. It was very windy coming in here, over 30 knots. And now we have this little harbor. And this big ferry is gonna come in here. Whoops, whoops. I think they reverse better than we do, babes. Much better. I mean, we, we basically, we can't. We basically do not reverse. <laughs> so this ferry says sailing together to the sustainable side of life. They probably don't have plastic straws because what's coming out of that chimney is <laughs> holy fuck. But at least they have sustainability on their agenda. Agenda. Greenwashing. Do not greenwash. Storm chip. <laughs> like it, babe? Yes. It's from Smögen. Smögen in Sweden. See that? Smögen said. <laughs> yeah, one of our favorite spots. Yeah. So, babe. Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Are you happy? Yeah. Tell the goat. <laughs> Tell them, huh? <laughs> Tell the good folks at home why you're so happy. Because are I'm about happy? to eat. And we saw a big turtle. And we, we didn't just see it, babe. We swam with it. Yeah, we went swimming with a big That's turtle. That's pretty amazing. Beer, a golden ale beer with Milo's honey, which I don't know how it tastes, but it's a Greek beer. And homemade bruschetta pancakes. Zucchini. Whatever, it's still fries, delicious. Fries. And with some garlic yogurt. Yeah. Delicious. If you want the recipe, subscribe to a, subscribe and become a Patreon. Yeah. Then you become. <laughs>
Hi. We are now in the south of Naxos in a little bay called Panormos or Panermos. We are a little bit trapped here. There's a lot of north wind all over the place and we're trying to make a little plan how to get north. And we haven't really figured it out. <laughs> so we are quite uh, frustrated so we thought we make a little beach cleanup today here on one of the little beaches. <laughs> And that's what we found. There wasn't it wasn't too dirty. There was a lot of little microplastics, everything random from ropes, brushes to bottom cups, a lot of bottom cups, uh, bottom cups, a lot of these little uh, lighting things for fishing, takes pipes, uh, straps, bottles, and shoes. A lot of shoes. It's weird how many shoes you find in the water. Yeah. I don't really understand I think my dad concept. found like at least a hundred shoes. <laughs> if you look for it, like you don't need to buy shoes ever again. Some of them are quite new as well. What are you people doing with your shoes? Yeah, keep them. They keep, keep them on your feet. Or don't wear them in Greece, you don't need shoes. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So the Miltemi this year has not really given us much of a break and it seems it will not. And we want to go to the parades again and to my hometown. We, we wanted to get around the east side, so Ikaria, Hio, Samos, uh, Lesbos, but that's not gonna happen for us, I think. So, for the people who don't know what Miltemi is, can you quickly explain it? Yeah, the Miltemi is like a standard wind, the prevailing wind in summer in Greece. It's formed because there's a low pressure over uh, the Turkey and Asia or Middle East and a high pressure over here and then creates this very constant wind also known as Etitian wind and, and this it blows is mainly from the, the north. north and northeast or northwest and yes it so it's kind of inconvenient when you want to go north yeah you're going straight into the wind and it accelerates pretty much in near Mykonos over yeah. Delos because as I read in the book now, uh, Delos is a godforsaken place. Okay, so the book that you're referring to is <laughs> Mythos by Stephen Fry. Yeah. And according to the old Greek myths, then what? They made sure that the god of Era made sure that it's super windy and inaccessible to go to Delos. Ah. So it always blows there like hell. Okay. Yeah. Well, there we have the scientific explanation for why yes, this is there happening. You go. Nonetheless, it's extremely inconvenient for us. So our plan now is we come up with a genius plan. Instead of going north, we will go first of all west towards uh, Sifnos, mm -hmm. maybe tomorrow. Try yeah. to go all west and then from there we bit out of the main acceleration zone. Acceleration zone? And then we will tuck away up north there. So this is like a, like, like a line of islands sort of so it's like the distances between islands are not so great yes and so then we can make there it is a, there's a possibility to abort mission if it's really terrible yeah and then we yeah. make it to Evia the long island and then yeah. we tuck in between there up yeah which we did last year which we and did we know it's okay yeah because it's a bit more sheltered so maybe we won't get as much swell at least hopefully yeah so. and it's quite nice now so we'll see what happens, but that's the plan. That, that's the journey for these next couple of weeks, and we will take you along with us. Yes. yes. And if you want to be part of cleaning Greek beaches mm -hmm. or any beaches, mm -hmm. uh, you can do so by becoming one of our patrons, and we will make sure with every contribution of yours, we will make sure to make a little beach cleanup in your name. Mm. So. You give us something and we give something back, not really to you, but more to the environment. Yeah. So that's, I guess, the way we figured out to uh, yeah, make you give us some money and we will work for it. Cool. cool. And cool. one last thing. Yeah. What do you guys think of Leo in my hat? Please comment in the section below. <laughs> I don't get to wear it anymore because he thinks it looks great in it. Yeah. Is it right? Let's let's go side shot there, babe. Oh yeah. Look at that. But it's only for sailing in no wind. Yeah. It doesn't really work. It's because I don't have any hair left. <laughs> Bye. Bye.